looks like we are about to start the elites with Madeline Medeiros. This her first season in elites that just wrapped up. She was the team world champion a year ago and outright won an elite competition, not once, but twice, beating all of the male competitors. Well, stepping up into the elite division is another level, but she's definitely got the experience in the teen division. And it's going to be interesting to see how she fares as the first competitor up. And already we have the links. Work of this course. Yeah, I love to see the links. You know, the elites just really take it to that next level, um, having no troubles whatsoever. And we see them her prepping up for Tire Dash, which is spelled disaster for a few previous competitors. Not Madeline, But though. making it look easy. Now, Driver's Ed is where people can come unstuck, but we're seeing the elites really step up here as Madeline lines up the second lache. Just the dismount. One for one. A buzzer in just <laughs> 38 domination. seconds. And that is the kind of action we are going to see in the elite division. Ma yeah, Madeline absolutely dominated that course there. It was really just such a smooth, clean run there. There were no faults, no concerns, no hiccups. And she got an incredible time there. And, and that's going to place her incredibly well and put the pressure on the other competitors. Okay, Ava watching on nervously in the background. Just, I guess, hoping for her spot to you, be... You never hope another ninja falls. True. I, Very true. I know placement matters, but... I don't think I've ever, even against my own best interest, read for a ninja to fall. Absolutely, yeah. And that is the beauty of the ninja community. Completely. Everyone comes together. And at the end of the day, it's the spirit of the sport. As Madeline moves through the first half of this course quite well, now moving on to Skyhooks, which is, of course, a difficult point, but as our last seeded ninja... Well, I mean, showing are, you, are you sure it was difficult? Madeline just made that look really easy. <laughs> yeah, and Madeline is proving to us why she is the last runner of this, this hate. Nice. Makes the hook, and she is on the kaleidoscope with plenty of time. She needs to beat this yeah. obstacle to advance to the Premier Series Finals. Definitely one of our fastest times, taking a bit of extra oh, time. Oh, look at that! She jumped out to the second one! Completely legal! Wow! Saving time there, showing the innovation there is incredible. Making the and grab, now, even with the uh, the uh, square spinning, and with 48 seconds in the bag, Madeline Medeiros has moved on to the Premier Series Finals and wants more. Wow. What an incredible run. I, the other ninjas are probably watching on being like, why didn't I do that on Kaleidoscope? But... Oh, missing. Oh, hey, what? How did she hang strength. on for that long? <laughs> just showing incredible strength in our elite division. It's just, it, there's nothing else like it. These, these elite ninjas are just on another level. And this obstacle will reach that set. She's got 38 seconds. This is definitely doable, Alex. We've yes. seen ninjas fall on boats before and go on to complete. So hopefully we can see this happen here. Madeline eyeing it up. There she goes. She's got it this time. Now she's she completed the this obstacle yes. with a slower time than Abby, which means if she wants to win this competition, she must beat Area 53 and hit that buzzer. And realistically, only has time to do it once. Could have gone on that swing. Goes on this swing now. Gets onto the ring. Now, Alex, this is the this is the turning point. This is the difficult one. Gets that vertical yes. disc. Could she do it? Reaches behind, spins, and Madeline Medeiros beats the buzzer <laughs> and wins the Premier Series at Ferox. What an incredible run, just demonstrating consistency through both stages and proving to us why she's worthy of being the champion here today. Madeline Medeiros just... is going to claim the gold medal and the first place prize money, earning her spot in the Premier Series Finals here at Ferox and bursting onto the ninja scene with an incredible performance, the only buzzer in the placement course going on to become the only buzzer in the challenge course. First of all, how she hung on for this long, I have no idea. <laughs> but gets it on the second attempt. Only needed one attempt, though, on Area 53. An obstacle that only one other competitor even got to. Just all round an incredible, incredible run. And just, just proof in the pudding. She was the only ninja to complete both courses, and, and that is a real testament and a well-deserved win.